Hello beautiful loving angels how have you been i hope you all been doing very well you are in good health so welcome back to another love pk card reading regarding your future spouse so in this reading we are going to see well like that this pk card reading is going to be regarding how much will your future spouse go crazy over your emotion gestures okay so in front of you there are three different groups okay three different charms are there in front of you each of you is going to lead you to a unique path where your future spouse feelings are going to be revealed through their reactions to your emotional gestures so for choosing the card just please close your eyes take a deep breath okay relax yourself and choose the charm that draws you the most behind each group behind each charm lies a reading that is going to be delving deep into how your future spouse will be captivated by your sweet and subtle actions so let's get started without wasting much of your time okay so see you with the readings hello group number 1 so let's find out how much crazy your future spouse is going to be go on over you you know when you are going to show them your innocent gestures the first card we have got your wow it's such a romantic person you are going to be with really yes knight of cups so i can see here that you have chosen the first door it is a door of devotion okay it is a door of devotion that you have chosen the person waiting for you beyond beyond it is someone who is going to be cherishing you cherishing the little things in life with you they will be deeply intuitive and very sensitive okay they will be able to pick up on even the smallest of your gestures whether it's a soft smile a gentle touch whatever it is or the way you subconsciously or unconsciously adjust yourself your dress your collar everything that little details that you even doesn't give a second thought to they will be notice it all and each of these actions are going to be sending ripples through their heart like that each and every gestures that you do that you pick that you show unnoticingly subconsciously they're going to be loving everything about it okay so dear group number one wow a truly truly passionate person your future spouse you know is someone who will be endlessly fascinated by how your innocent gestures reveal your aff affection they will be truly will be very affectionate towards you deeply there will be a nostalgic familiarity between you and your partner especially they're going to feel towards you like that uh, you two are someone who is deeply connected with one another they are going to feel like that it is not a connection that is born only in this lifetime okay this is a connection they're going to feel like that it is uh, like a journey that they have always you know took this path with you from a very long or period of time long long from since long long ago okay so i see here that when you're going to be pouring them maybe a cup of tea okay without even being asked they will receive it as a sign of your care okay and your thoughtfulness okay so this is what i'm getting here this is going to be a six card reading okay and uh, yeah so i see here that a simple act like pressing the lint of your jacket will make them feel cherished and loved every small action that you take okay every small detailing things that you do whether it is a casual compliment or a light touch on their arm as you walk by will have a profound impact on your future person i see that they will be often find themselves you know uh reflecting on this moments long after they have passed i uh, like i said that your person is going to be very thoughtful about you everything that you do, do is going to be leaving an impact on you, on them it is going to be influence them okay when you are maybe apart they will be really going to be repay these gestures in their mind replay it when you will be away from them maybe during the day or you will be away for one or two days or maybe you are going to be some spending some kind of vacation with your loved ones whatever the scenario is so they will be severing them like a sweet memory 
okay your innocence and sincerity is definitely going to be touched their heart so deeply that they will find it hard to imagine a life without you without your presence their love for you will be grow with its innocent action it will be creating a bond that's both deep and enduring your future spouse will go to great lengths you know yes extra uh, lengths to reciprocate this love so they will be showering you with affection and return like that they will be endlessly moved by how naturally you express your feelings without even uh, you know thinking about it okay i see that uh, from the moment you both are going to be meeting one another they will be drawn to the way you express yourself through these subtle actions perhaps it is the way you look at them with genuine curiosity or how you instinctively actually offer a helping hand to them okay without a second thought each of these gestures will resonate deeply within them it will make them feel seen understood and cherished your innocent gestures will be very uh it will like it will be the very essence of what they love most about you this person is someone who is going to be cherishing your authenticity it they will find beauty in the smallest details and it is going uh, they are going to be holding you in high regard okay i see your future spouse okay mm, having difficulty in choosing words to confess their feelings or to tell you actually how they truly feel about you your future person is likely someone who values acts of service and uh, small meaningful gestures you can say okay they will be notice every little thing you do even those actions you might consider trivial like that it will be not matter to you like i said before for intense the way you always make sure that they have everything that they need before you uh before you settle down to relax or how you surprise them with something small but significant to so show that you were thinking of them like um making their favorite food bringing them a uh, you know a bouquet or even a single rose or playing their favorite movie or television series in the um, in the television okay uh, whatever it is smallest details this ex will be treasured treasured like precious gems in their heart for you each one deepening in their admiration for you they will often find themselves reflecting on these gestures they gonna often find it okay because of this two card i am getting here that they will you know often reflect on these gestures they will be marvel at how naturally and effortlessly you show your care it is not just the grand declaration of love okay it is not about um uh, what you are doing it is not it doesn't have to be grand but the quiet moments where your affection actually going to shine through in the most unexpected ways you're going to be sometimes showing them your wild side sometimes your innocent side they will come to realize that these innocent actions are a true reflection of your love pure and unfiltered and this realization will make them fall even harder for you okay so over time this gestures will become the foundation of your relationship your spouse will go to great lengths to reciprocate with your love with your feelings with your emotions not because they will going to feel that they have to do it because it is their responsibility but because they will be moved by the way you are going to express yourself they will try to strive to create a life for you especially both of you that will fill with the small loving moments because they will know how much they mean to you and you to them their love for you will be a constant unwavering force driven by their deepest admiration for your sincerity i see that your kindness is going to be putting them in awe your innocent gestures will be the light that guides their heart making them feel like the luckiest person in the world to have found someone as a genuine person as you their affection will grow with its passing day and they will never cease to be amazed by how deeply you touch their soul with your actions
this is just a beautiful reading i found it so mesmerizing like that it is you know i'm finding it hard to say that yes you might be thinking that i am sugar coating things but it is a huge idea sugar today i made sugar coat you but what about tomorrow when the reality will come to in front of you right so before getting into a commitment forever and ever eternity first always try to know your person beforehand spend time to spend time with them before getting into commitment forever like marriage or engagement because once taking this step there is no turning back whether you will be having this similar feelings with them or not you have to consider it beforehand okay so that you can't blame yourself or the other person for what you have been actually anticipated but what you didn't got from them so rather than regretting later it is best to regret beforehand okay so i see great potential between you and your partner your spirit guardian winter of winter reflecting pool pine spirit all are here to guide you through yes they are telling you to retreat for now your spirit guardian of winter is telling you to retreat right now from the hassle and bustle of your life you might be not paying attention to things that you need to pay attention to okay i see here that they are saying and they are silent deep peace within you you are going to find something renewing within you so retreat yourself repair your body repair your items and your relationships there might be something that you were not actually paying attention to examine your life and make adjustment as needed what's your nocturnal dreams meditate look for messages from the spirit around you they might be already available but you are not actually seeing them or you are avoiding them or you are not trying to connect with them this card is indicating that it's time to pull back from people okay and situation and that do not actually empower or support you let go of anything or any wanted drains you and protect yourself from less than positive influences it's time to renew your energy incubate your dreams for the future make plans for tomorrow remember that it is a season of rest and recuperation okay so relax stop the business of life and relax don't get overwhelmed care for your body replenish your inner resources take care of your health your mental health your physical health they need the most utmost you know consideration from you right now you might be working very hard right now you might be trying to be everywhere but it is not possible right you are also human so in silence you will find the dwelling place of your soul so take time to move into in a quiet place and you will uncover a vast store of insight emerging within you in on ongoing situation in your life hold back try to hold back a little take time to reflect before responding okay there is stillness it means that you might need stillness right now in stillness only your power is going to may emerging so tap into your inner sacred witness to discover the dwelling place of your soul in profound peace and silence you will what you will discover the truth of your real being what you are actually have come into this life for if you are in pain go into the stillness until you find the source resist the temptation to indulge in feelings of overwhelming urgency emergency or if you might be uh, not talking to someone recently you might have the urge to get connect with that person immediately but hold on into this temptation don't let you get swept into this temptation okay there is always a higher truth that you need to seek out there is really really a higher higher force that is wanting you to be still right now your soul loves actually what is real and honest to seek solitude to hear the voice of spirit surrender to it and serenity will follow into your life 
So pain spirit purification. It means that you need to let go of all the old, discarded and unused things from your life. Whether it is a situation, whether it is a person, whether it is a circumstance, whether the things that you may be gathering in your house, whatever they are. Purify and cleanse and clutter clear your home, your body, your life. Release whatever doesn't serve or support you. Take time for a total purification. You will feel brighter and also be a clearer channel for the light will open up for you. Your energy field is going to be being cleansed of all that is, um, you know, that doesn't, uh, that you doesn't need. Okay. Cleanse your body, your environment by doing cleaning, space clearing and clutter clearing. Anything that feels dark and murky in your life, let it go. It is not empowering you. It is draining you. When your auric field is cluttered and energy is dingy, you can't see the world clearly and it will have trouble. You will have trouble hearing the messages from the spirit. So the time has come to lighten up, eat and live highly, lightly. Before a shiny, vibrant new cycle can begin, it is essential to let go of the old. Remember it. Okay. The brilliance is going to be pouring through you. It will gonna shine throughout your life. And it is also going to help many people through you as well. So first, clear the path. You have to make it clear. Okay? So this is the reading I got for you, my beautiful group number one. I hope you enjoyed this reading. I hope you got what kind of partner is waiting for you in the horizon. I will come up with another reading. Please still take care and see you next time. Hello my beautiful group number 2. So you have chosen the group number 2. So let's find out about your person. How much crazy your person is going to be going over your innocent gestures. So you have chosen the second group, the path of emotional depth. Okay. By choosing this second path, it is going to bring you into the wall where emotions is going to be running deep. And connections are going to be forced through shared experiences and heartfelt understanding. Before that, you need to be isolated. You need to be understanding. Okay, I see a person is going through an awakening phase. They will be ready in no time. Okay, so your future spouse is someone who feels things intensely and seeks a partner who can match their emotional depth. Okay, and when they encounter your emotions, gestures, they will be profoundly moved. Seeing in you a kinder and um, you know, um, yes, um, a kind of spirit actually who uh, is going to be understanding them or understanding the power of subtitle. So it is a person who is going to be very emotional, deeply awakened, a person who will be ready for love, a person who will search within you for a partner who is going to be connected within with them in a deeper level. You are going to be getting clarity about your own life, where you stand in this person's life. I see great blessings coming into your life with this person. This person is going to be likely to be someone who is going to be appreciating the little things in life, the moments that others might overlook. Okay? So when you do something as simple as remembering their favorite book, offering them a comforting word, when they are down, when they are down, they will be grateful. Okay? It will be like a strike, a chord within them. The resonance long after the moment has passed. It will always will be very rewarding for them. They will see these gestures as evidence of your emotional intelligence and your ability to truly see them for who they are. Okay? So your future spouse will be someone who finds um, comfort and security in your actions. They will notice how you go out of your way to make uh, feel loved and valued. How much you uh, show that you support them even in the smallest of ways whether it's the way you listen to them whether they need to vent or how you always seem to know when they need a little extra support 
they will be deeply appreciated of how in tune you are with their needs okay so this innocent gestures will become a source of strength for your relationship your spouse will look to you as your emotional anchor okay i see the person who can steady them when the whole wall feels overwhelming they will often reflect on how fortunate they are to have someone like you in their life someone who cares so deeply and expresses that care is in such meaningful ways such meaningful ways you are going to show them their love for you will be intense and unwavering you know driven by the deep emotional connection that you can share with one another okay so they will find themselves falling more in love with you with each passing day as your emotions that there is going to be continue to reveal the depth of your feelings or warm warmed okay ah uh, yes the emotional bond uh, that you will be going to share is going to become the cornerstone of your relationship it is going to provide a solid foundation upon which you both are going to build a life together okay i see that your person will be financially very stable they are going to provide you the security the love safe you know that a real couple do need in their life so i see your future spouse will be so moved by your actions uh, that they will strive to be the best partner they can be i see this person is going to be do that constantly they will be working to nurture and strengthen your relationship okay your bond with them they will be someone who will know that its gestures no matter how small it is is going to be a reflection of your love and care for them that they gonna feel that you have for them their affection for you will be boundless okay they will be feeling like that it is something that they didn't never sees to amaze them that how deeply you touch their heart with your emotion gestures it will be like telling them that you are someone they need to take care of they need to cherish you okay your emotion gestures are something that is going to be pulling them towards you more harder i see that you both will be able to get the clarity about one another through these gestures you don't have to talk or you know tell about what you are feeling or going through in your life your partner will be noticing every single little details that you will be showing them whether you are down whether your mood is upset or not they will be able to tell about your react by your reaction by your by the way your face is face is going to change reactions okay so i see here that despite how much you will be someone you know who is going to be go through a little bit of tense situation you will be showing them that you are okay this is going to touch them to a limit that they gonna think that you are always going out of your way to make them feel relaxed unworried and you're always doing your best to make them feel relaxed and secure so they will also want to do the similar things for you i see that they will be providing you unwavering loyalty their person is someone who is going to be showing you that they are having unwavering loyalty towards you they will be someone who is always going to be proving you that they are always by your side no matter where you are standing no matter where you stand they are always going to be having your back having your side okay your person will be showering you with all love they will be truly will be amazingly in love with you okay i see that they will be someone who is always going to be taking on the burdens okay i see that they will be seeing it that you are always trying to give them lesser and lesser trouble lesser and less worries you may be someone who always deal with these things on your own even never letting your partner know that what you are actually going through or what kind of situations you are facing but they are not blind they will be able to see what you are actually going through or facing even without telling i see an amazing partner in your life here this person is going to be bringing the happiness that you truly want in your life 
but like I said that it is it is only going to be bound to come into your life when you will be truly feeling about these feelings are going to be rising in, in heart in your heart when you will be finally meeting this person and this person similarly makes you feel this way okay once you are going to make sure that it is this is how this person is making me feel they are making me feel relaxed they they are making me feel wanted needed they are someone who is standing standing with me despite knowing that uh, you know that i have done something wrong but still they will be protecting you defending you not because that they want to uh, you know you know you know they want to just um, what i will say is that they want to save their face but because they doesn't want you to get humiliated or embarrassed in front of others they will be always will be there to you know to save the day for you this is what i am seeing here you may not feel it right away you will only feel this energy when you are finally going to meet this person okay so i see here the great energy is there i uh, we have got here the fire spirit the blue bird spirit the secret spring so these energies are here these spirit guides are here to tell you that you are an incredible person dear okay and your life force is very energetic you are a passionate person you are expanding in your life so if you are not have started till now then start doing things your own way because i see here that you might someone who feel drained by the expectations of others very quickly you are someone who always hold back this is what is actually holding your spark to get ignited you doesn't speak the truth you always say what actually the other person loves to hear from you but it is not always going to do good to you so don't hold back speak your truth let the light of the creator surge through you take action rather than rather than procrastinating take action this is not a time to hold back in life you have hold it back enough long okay enough dear you need to move on dear you need to take control of your life you might think like that the time will come into my life when i will act upon myself but it is not going to come unless you take action do not repress what you feel or allow yourself to be drained by others you cannot keep every person in your life happy one or the other person is always going to be dissatisfied by you people doesn't care about what you feel even your dearest and your loveliest loveliest person is not actually going to be feeling the same way for you the way you want them to feel or the similar way you gonna feel for them it is a truth it is a reality it is harsh but it is this is what it is so if you strive to meet everyone's expectations and fulfill the needs of others you're forgetting yourself you're forgetting to honor your own needs your energy field is becoming more depleted and dull day by day it is darkening your light is vanishing so break free from this constraints who is constraining you who are they they to judge you for what you are doing did they ever cared about whenever they did something wrong to you say something harsh to you or acted the way you didn't want them to act did they ever thought about it they didn't but you always played along with them to keep the environment clean and happy you drained yourself you consumed the darkness to give them light but in return what you got they constrained it you they binded you whether you might be self inflicted or imposing whether it is something that you are doing to yourself or others are imposing on you you need to activate your verve and your passion give your emotions the free reins that it truly deserve wave of energy will surge through you as you spontaneously express yourself run on your own resources however it can be depleting so allow the creator to flow through you be open to receive 
know that you don't have to do it all by yourself. This replenishes your soul and supports you in assessing enormous amount of energy. When you're going to surrender to the Almighty, to the God that you truly, truly, you know, always pray to, you follow whichever religion you belong from, from whichever country you are, whichever God you just pray to, it doesn't matter. Allow yourself, surrender yourself. Believe that the Creator is supporting you. Your soul is replacing the energy. The power of fire spirit is renowned. You might be a fire spirit. You might fire spirit might be nearby you. You could be a fire sign. One of the four prime elements. You are capable of transformation. You are capable of great passion, zeal, enthusiasm, creativity, and activation. Okay? So go for it. Let the energy of fire inspire action and movement for you now. Now is the time for you to shine. Never wait for the day to come. It will never come unless you stand up for yourself. All is well. You have to say yourself to this. Yes to your life. Yes to everything that you do. Yes to everything that you feel right for yourself and let your doubts dissolve. Don't wait until the future. Live fully just now. You do not need to struggle or suffer to grow. You can grow leaps and bounds and enjoy your life. Joy will follow you. You know happiness is coming into your life. You just need to see it through. That the darkness is vanishing and light is coming to you. Okay? This card is actually the harbinger of delight. Celebrate and have fun. Embrace life, yourself. And also the others. Not the maybe a uh, way you always used to, but do it in a different way. Say yes today, show to the class and let your doubts dissolve. All is well. It's simple. Your life is life. Your life is full of life. It is to you need to experience happiness. This is what you're waiting for. That's all that is required of you as a soul. You do not need to be unhappy to please another. Okay? Remember this. So affirm today, happiness and ecstasy flow through me widely and freely. Focus on the areas of your life that brings you happiness and those areas will prosper in your life. You will see yourself brightening, glowing. Success will flow into your life. Vitality and a glowing youthful renewal of your body will generate. It will occur. Now is the time to take action in, and in support of your dreams. There is no need to struggle. The universe has your back. You need to remember this. All things are possible. The more you honor and celebrate the success that you already have, the more success pours into your life. And the more you feel it, the more love, prosperity, fame, fortune will, have, will come into your life. You will have it. Act as if and feel as if you are wildly successful and even more successful will develop. Accept that you are already thriving. You are and the more victories will emerge into your life. If your situation seems to knock you down, get up. And take a moment to explore what you learn. And then keep going. Okay? Good fortune. Blessed. Those who honor the spirit of the sacred spring. Remember, you have to emerge from the spring. Okay? You have to know that you are successful beyond, beyond measure. You are blessed beyond measure. And it will become a reality. It can become a reality overnight. You just have to believe. So this is what I have got for you, my beautiful, beautiful group number two. I will come with another prayer with you. Please till then take care and see you next time. Hello, beautiful group number three. So let's find out how your future spouse, how much your future spouse is going to be go crazy over your innocent gestures. Wow, we have got the six of coins and this is a path of gentle seduction that you have chosen. Okay, so stepping through this door, what you have conquered here, what you have got to here. I see here that you are someone, you know, who has, um, who has just got into this person's mind and soul. They appreciate you. You are their admiration, you know, you just, uh, they just couldn't actually take their eyes off from you. 
you are someone that you know you and your person is going to be that playful have that playful romance so this door is going to be leading you to a world of playful romance with your future spouse where your future spouse finds joy in the way of way uh, of your innocent gestures it is going to light up your world there is someone who is going to be valuing humor fun and lightheartedness in this relationship and uh, your subtle and enduring actions are like be like a breath of fresh air to them okay so wow we have two queens here you are powerful you know you're confident these things are going to be very much alluring for your partner yes i see that your person is a very kind hearted person very kind soul you can say there is someone you know with whom you will be able to live your life with full to your fullest okay we have very powerful cards here for you dear and i see here that they're going to notice the way you laugh at their jokes even the silly ones or the way you absent mindedly play with your hair when you are deep in thought even your smallest gesture you doesn't play a, any attention to at all they will be very much you and no going to be strike them real hard i can see here that the small innocent actions that you going to make is going to be making them smile when you might be watching something might be in your phone or in tv and you are smiling or you are giggling you are busting out in laughter without even someone uh, noticing that someone else could be actually paying attention to what you were doing or when you are eating something whether you when you are sleeping okay so this type of small gestures you even even don't think about they will find themselves falling deeper for you it's time you do that your future spouse is a type actually who will be endlessly amused and charmed by your gestures they will be reflecting your it will be actually reflecting your unique personality that you have you might be not someone who does this kind of things purposely or you know yes you are a strong person you are someone who acts like you know you are an untouchable person you are someone who acts like that you are someone who is very grounded but sometimes you also do silly things that you might doesn't pay attention to so they will adore the way you tease them okay they will adore the way you tease them gently or the way you surprise them with small thoughtful gifts even something as simple as the way you greet them after a long day will become something they look forward to each day each passing day every day okay your innocent actions will be the epitome that is going to spark their inner soul that is going to keep the romance between the two of you alive constantly it is going to remind them of why they fell in love with you in the first place okay so your future spouse will be captivated by you effortlessly it is going to bring joy and light into their life they will often find themselves thinking about your gestures and long after even they have happened in their life maybe something that happened long before okay even after some time even after passing a long time its memory will bring a smile to their face they will bring they will cherish the playfulness you bring into the relationship they will seeing it as a vital part of your connection their love for you will grow its with its playful and innocent gestures that you are going to be showing them or that you are going to be creating because it is going to be creating a relationship filled with warmth laughter and endless affection okay i truly truly see here that from the very beginning actually they will be drawn to your playful nature and the way you express your affection through small seemingly insignificant actions whether is the way you tease them with a wink or how you surprise them with a sweet treat just because you thought of them this gesture will have a profound impact on them they will see them as a reflection of your fun loving spirit and your ability to make every moment very special together your future person will be someone who thrives on the energy and excitement 
you bring into their life they will do their utmost to adjust into your life to bring adjustment into your relationship they will adore the way you make them laugh and how you always seem to know how to brighten their day okay they will be always protective of you defensive of you they will always will be someone who is going to be you know making try to be giving you the best they can offer sometimes there might be something that goes wrong and you feel down okay even that things is not going to be unseen by this person this the innocent gestures that you are going to be showing them is going to becoming a source of their joy for them so when you are not going to be some, let them say this so they will be reminded that something had actually gone wrong okay because they are going to feel lucky that they have found someone who can actually make them smile even on the darkest days so they will be trying to be there for you when you face the darkest day of your life so over time this playful gestures will become a defining feature of your relationship okay your spouse will be come to rely on your ability to lighten the mood and bring a sense of fun and adventure into your life they will find themselves eagerly anticipating these moments looking forward to the little surprises that you might be creating by bringing the sweet gestures that your relationship because of this innocent and sweet gestures your relationship is going to be coming something special right so they will be looking forward to it their love for you will be passionately increased day by day it will become intense they will it will be filled by you it will be something that you are going to make them feel alive you are making them feel cherished okay they will be completely captivated by your ability to express your love in such a way light heartedly they will be doing everything they can do to reciprocate that love your innocent gestures will become the foundation of your relationship that is going to fill with laughter joy and endless affection your future spouse will be so enamored with you that they will find themselves constantly thinking about how you make them so happy and you you just make their day you just make them they will strive to create a life for you both that is filled with love laughter unforgettable memories moments they will be wanting to capture it their affection for you will grow with its passing day they will never cease to be amazed actually and feel lucky to have you as a partner they will feel so deeply touched by you by the innocent gestures that you are going to be showing them so it will be like one of a kind that you will, you know they're going to feel that yes this is my partner they will be feeling proud to show you off to the world they will feel proud to just you know uh, unknowingly they will be go on babbling about you what a wonderful partner you are how much joy and happiness you bring into their life what a graceful person you are okay so moving forward i can see here that we have got for you a message from your spirit guides the spirit guides of earth spirit hummingbird spirit and the wise woman of the grove has messages for you my dear they want to let you know something that you were might be not seeing or not actually paying attention to but they are here to tell you actually what you are lacking to see through okay so they are here to tell you that be present in the moment slow down and let go of all the busyness and frenetic phase of life explore your roots honor your past go deeper if you want to uncover something like a secret or anything reflect on your life as well it's time to make take measure of your life and put your roots down you need to assess actually who you are and where you are standing right now make plans for the future but don't act on those plans until you feel secure in stepping forward whether it is planning your future with marrying someone or graduating or taking on a different job the uh, shifting your location anything whether it is romantic material or related to your health or your concern about your career whatever it is this is a time to preparing and going deeper okay so you might be someone who are feeling that you are aren't grounded and you need to create more stability into your life okay so think things through before you take action take time to plan your future plan your schedule 
plan whatever you want to do next carefully don't rush into anything strength is growing within you it is sure that it is growing you might be feeling very secure and very much stronger from before but security and protection is something that is surrounding you it is also true you are safe but you need to think before making any kind of financial investment okay secure yourself and when we have got this card for you the earth spirit card is telling about stability so it is telling us that it is a good time to do so it's not a time to take risk it is time for you to securely and think through before doing anything serious okay you are a stable and a strong person but you need to know that um, by taking risk into something is not going to do anything good for you okay you are actually now in a place where you need to plant your seeds you are going to harvest later abundance which is going to be bringing abundance into your life in the future but before that you have to take the time to nurture yourself nurture your beginnings they might come in many forms they might come in various phases or various shapes so replenish yourself true happiness comes from following the dictates of your soul what your soul is telling you what your heart is telling you are you happy for uh, where you are or what you are feeling right now are you okay with that life is changing constantly even your life is constantly changing right now so be open to change and look for joy in the moment find your boundaries find your boundaries and create your boundaries and stand strong discover your joy and remember in your heart that all is going to be well so open your heart to celebration and fun who told you that you need to suffer to grow has anyone told you and if that person if anyone has told you that that person is totally wrong okay your soul expands in leaps and bounds through following your pleas you're going to express your love you need to express it you need to embrace life you need to especially embrace yourself the way you are who you are what you are why you are being someone else to be happy be yourself to be happy and remember that what others think doesn't concern you if you have been waiting until circumstances are different before you know allow yourself to experience joy remember mark my word you have waited long life is always changing if you don't flow follow your bliss now then when will you follow it when will you follow your dreams when you will you stand take stand for yourself your purpose in life is to experience joy so you have to take steps forward towards yourself that now while protecting your personal boundaries don't let anyone cross those boundaries you don't need to do anything everything all at once but you do need to start when you will start start right now happiness spreads to others like wildflower and it can also heal the wounds it can also help to help to heal the wounds you might be wounded you might be not even considering to look at yourself right now you might be going through something but you are not seeing it through why if you are not going to be there for yourself then who will be the more the more time you spend yourself no one is going to be giving you the attention that you always want from the another person the person who is going to be attending you is you yourself the amount of love you that, that you want from another person is not going to give you until you give that amount of happiness or love to yourself okay remember to replenish yourself it's about the time to enjoy the joy of your journey you are bound to reach the destination of your life don't fly backward fly forward this is what we are here to know and this is what your message is for is so the wise woman of the grove has a beautiful message for you my dear you are at the advent of a remarkable time of ease wisdom healing joy and inspiration your ability to hear you might be have the ability to hear the voices of spirit 
But you could be someone who is a very intuitive person or could be someone who we could call the psychic type who used to see dreams that is related to reality. It often comes true. Like you see it like a vision. If such the thing is happening with you or you are such a person that remember it is a gift of grace. Spirit guardians are watching over you with immense love and kindness. Being in the state of grace means that being blessed by the divine forces. You are blessed by the divine forces. Okay? You can relax and let go now. Speak with love and kindness. Okay? Spiritual nobility is growing within you. The spirit of grace is softly unfolding in your life. It might be not something that you are seeing through right now, but it is happening. Kindly honor the truth of others as well. Even if you don't agree or if you know better because remember the creator knows better than anyone else and the creator knows the truth and it will come into the light later or sooner the person might be who has caused you any kind of pain any kind of agony anything that has someone has done to you any kind of hurtful that person is bound to pay for their deeds so let them go leave them forgive them you are forgiving yourself, not forgiving them. Karma will never forgive another person who is going to be causing you any kind of pain or suffering. Remember what I have told you just now? Before loving someone else, first of all, love yourself. Be always there for yourself. Okay? So this is where I'm ending my reading. I hope you have enjoyed this reading. Such a beautiful person is waiting for you over the horizon. I hope you meet this person and enjoy a blissful family life with this person in the future. I will meet you in another reading. Please then take care and see you next time.